Hi everyone, hope you have a great day. So as I was reading here in Hebrews 7 from the words of Paul, he's talking to the Hebrews obviously, and he says in verse 27, Who needs not daily as those high priests to offer up sacrifice, first for his own sins and then for the people's? For this he did once when he offered himself. So he says that we do not need to offer up a sacrifice like the Levites did because we have Yeshua. Because he died for us, he became our final lamb, right? Because the sacrifices weren't, they weren't doing it right anymore. So Yeshua became the final sacrifice, right? He came back to restore his Torah that was broken. It was constantly broken by the Israelites. And verse 28 says, For the Torah makes men high priests which have infirmity, but by the word of the oath, which was since the Torah, the Son is consecrated forevermore. So he says the Torah and the Son are declared forever, right? They are all they are there forever. So we cannot get rid of them because they are they are like set in stone. We cannot get rid of these, right? These, these are declared forever. And so when it says consecrated forevermore, that means they're not going away. That means they are staying, right? If you say they're, if you say the Torah is gone, that means you all say the Son is gone because the, because the Torah was also consecrated along with Yeshua, Jesus the Christ. So I hope you guys are having a great day. I encourage you to read your Bibles and read the first five books of the Bible, Torah, and learn and understand. Have a great day.